There's a new effort to keep indie businesses free from graffiti, all while adding just a pop of color to city yeah, streets. Pretty unique idea. It's a small art project you might not notice if you don't know where to look. Luckily, our Meredith Juliet found it, and she is with the artists helping to make it all happen. Hey, good morning. Good morning, guys. Well, this was an incredibly competitive process. 65 artists applied to paint this wall behind me, and that might surprise you because take a look at where I am. I'm at a Jiffy Lube. Kyle Ragsdale was the artist eventually selected and who completed the, art, the mural behind me. He completed it on Friday, and he's a pretty well-known local artist. He also has a mural downtown on the canal. He's now completed one of 14 of the Jiffy Lube murals. These are going to go all across central Indiana, all at different Jiffy Lubes and all by different artists. It's all part of a coalition called Every Part Matters Mural Project. So how did we get here? Well, back in 2016, the Jiffy Lube in Broad Ripple was being graffitied and, quote, tagged. And they uh, paint murals over graffiti, and the graffiti artists seem to respect that and don't tag it anymore. So it started just as a, a little, hey, let's cover up this graffiti, and it's blossomed into a national award-winning campaign for us. It's, it's really been amazing. It's through a partnership with the Arts Council of Indianapolis, and Kyle tells me he thinks it's really cool to bring art to a street that might not have any. He says you're driving down this street and you see a lot of logos that you recognize. You see McDonald's, you see Burger King, and then you see this, and maybe you have to stop for a second and think and get creative. Ben and Alyssa. It's a great idea. I mean, it looks really, really cool, too, at a pretty unique spot. I'm glad Meredith found yeah. it for us. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully they have some spotlights coming up, so illuminating them there. Thank you very much, Meredith.